Good morning, everybody. Happy Tuesday. Getting situated here in my spot. Don't mind me. I am so excited right now. I am getting ready to go get a massage. It has been over two months since I get a, got a massage and I get a massage, or I used to, every week because of working out and um, how just tolling and taxing it is on your body. So that's why I look so bleh, because I'm literally just gonna have my face down <laughs> for like an hour. So what is up you guys? Um, welcome to Des's Daily Dose. We're doing Thoughtful Thursday today. So I will be giving away something um, at the end of this. So hopefully I don't forget because I'm still drinking my coffee. What's up Junior, how are you doing this morning? Hope you're doing well. Um, the weather here is just so weird in Southern California. It's cold, it's cold and cloudy and sun's here and there. Just like randomly the other day, it just started to rain. So I don't mind, I don't mind the rain if it's warm out, but it wasn't warm out, it was chilly. And I'm like, whew, we're in May now, you guys, we're in May. I'm not ready for that June gloom yet. So, if you guys are just tuning in, tell me what's up, tell me what is on your plans for today. I see um, on people's social media that some states are opening back up and um, restaurants are starting to open and just a few different little things here and there to try to bring us back to life. Um, but man, there's also some negative, negative stuff flowing around too, so I'm trying not to let that consume me because like it, like I always tell you guys, you gotta kind of get rid of the toxic, but you also gotta kind of be aware of what's going on, but you also can't believe all the BS and everything that you're, you're seeing out there. So you gotta kind of take in some and throw away the rest, right? So thoughtful Thursday. What are we gonna do today that's a thoughtful gesture towards somebody? So. Even the littlest things would make someone's day, you guys. Sending them a nice text, just saying that you're thinking about them. Um, sending them just a card in the mail. So this is actually something I did with my clients. Um, I just sent them just like a cute little card in the mail, just letting them know that I'm thinking about them. I hope that them and their family are doing okay. And, um, you know, just a sign of letting them know that I'm thinking about them. Ah, uh, Junior, I'm gonna pray for you, buddy. I'm trying to rebuild your heart and kidneys. I know I've been watching your posts and, you know, I'm praying for you. I'm praying for you. So I hope that um, everything works out in the end, but I don't know what you are believing in faith, but um, whatever is God's will is God's will. You know, and I just like I talked about the other day, we all have an expiration date and we don't know when that is. I mean, I could die today in a, a crash. God forbid that it happened, but um, at least I know that I've found the Lord and um, I'm okay. I'm okay with all of that. I mean, it was sad for my kids, but um, I, I'm okay. So... Thought for Thursday, going back to just sending random and doing random acts of kindness. And so that's why today I've decided that I'm gonna be doing a giveaway as um, one of my things of random act of kindness. So what's up, Raylene? Can't wait to see you. Oh, Raylene, I'm so sorry to tell you, but I just saw that Arizona is reopening and unfortunately you're coming back to California that we don't have an open date. So, um, I hope you're ready to be quarantined with me. <laughs> so, um, what are you going to do for somebody today as a random act of kindness? Um, because just remember, just that little thing, that, it doesn't even have to cost any money. It doesn't have to cost any money to do something nice for somebody. Um, you know, like I said, a card. Like, even if you have just like a, uh, or a letter, like writing somebody a letter, that would... I mean, I would, that would be amazing if somebody just sent me a letter just to say, hey, how are you? You know, 
and just anything. So if you guys want me to send you a letter, PM me your address and I will send you something in the mail because we all love, you know, a little bit of communication and a little bit of love and thoughtfulness. Um, and we all like to get mail. That's not bills, right? <laughs> so that's why I like to share when I get boxes in the mail with you guys, because it's always like some fun stuff, always some fun stuff. Sierra wants one too. Well, send me your address and by the time you get back to California, it'll be in your mailbox in California. So send me the address over there because I don't remember it. So I'll send you guys a card or something, something. So, but stay on here if you are just jumping on because I am doing a giveaway today. And so I want to see in here what type of random act of kindness you guys are gonna do for somebody out there today because I'm calling this Thoughtful Thursday and it's always nice to make somebody's day just a little bit better. So what are you going to do? Because, you know, I love to do nice things for people. I love to, um, you know, like I said, send them a card. Just let them know that I'm thinking about them and um, just, just to make, it, make their day just a little bit better. And uh, it's nice because people are going through so much. Like even me sitting here right now, like I'm still de dealing with the struggles of, my son and um, we have another uh, fallback with that, that situation yesterday. So just a constant, a constant struggle in that department. But you know, God is good, God is faithful. Um, and all I can do is just, you know, just smile and know that it is just a temporary road bump and everything. So that's why it's nice to do things for people because for one, it makes me feel better um, because I like to bring a smile to people's face. And two, um, it's gonna make that person just have a better day because we all are going through crap and it just really sucks sometimes. And so if you can just make someone's day better it just makes you feel better so that's why i love to do stuff like this oh raylene look at that raylene sending somebody not naming names a hundred dollars for helping me and because i know they need it that is awesome i love that act of kindness i'm gonna be sending i'm giving away something today on this live and i am going to be sending out some other things to other people so if you guys are tuning in drop me your address Everybody knows Junior's address now, so let's all send Junior a, a little something in the mail. Love that. Let's make give him a smile. He is going through a rough patch. His body is just not cooperating, and sometimes that stinks. Your mom just hurt you, Sierra. Sometimes we say mean things in anger, and the best thing that you can do is just know that it's not because they love you any less. So, all right, so who's ready for a giveaway? So you guys know that I do multiple businesses um, online. And so one of the things that I love most, and I use multiple of these every single day, are these amazing sprays. So I'm going to be sending out two of these so i'm picking two winners today and it's going to be of your choice so i'll tell you kind of what they are so these are all natural sprays you spray them in your mouth and um they don't have they don't have cbd in them so if you're worried about cbd it does not have any cbd in them um they are all made of different uh, vitamins roots and uh, minerals and so really, really awesome. So I use this Boost one. You guys see me posting about this all the time. This is for when you want to have a little bit of extra, extra energy for your workout. So that has like coffee bean extract and I believe B12. Um, Brain has like all your B vitamins. So you can tell when I do these things and I actually do my brain spray um, when I get up in the morning and when I don't. I'm not kidding. Sometimes I have some serious like, uh, <laughs> missing brain cells it seems like in the morning 
um, shield. I use that one all the time, every single day right now, just because of all of this. So this, um, all the stuff that's going on with sickness and I'm trying to build a better immune system. So I use this one every day. Um, this helps keep my body alkaline. So it's alkaline formula. Sleep. I don't have any problems in the sleepy department. Um, and I already do take the CBD and melatonin um, capsules that we have. So, but this one has, so this doesn't have CBD in it. This is that spray. It has melatonin and some other things to help you get to sleep. Um, trim, I use this one on a regular, you guys, on a regular. This is how I'm controlling my appetite right now because when you can't do anything, you get bored and all you wanna do is eat or go through a drive through right? So this sucker, I do this three times a day, like 30 minutes before a meal. And this is like, there's a huge challenge going on within our business. And um, so many people are losing weight on this. So if you guys are just tuning on, I'm talking about doing a giveaway right now. I'm not trying to sell you anything. These are, I'm giving away two of these. So because it's Thoughtful Thursday. And then this one right here, last one is Peak. Peak makes you a freak. It has um, root antler velvet in it and some other th things. Um, but it really helps bring you a strong immune system. Also here, it helps really good for your libido. Um, so Peak and Sleep are the ones that I have not tried yet. The other ones I use on a regular basis. So if you are just tuning in and if you're still on here, I am giving away, I am giving away two of these. So one to each person. So there'll be two winners. So I'm just gonna ask um, one question and the first two people that get the right answer are going to, or the first people that type as fast as they can to get their answer pop up um, on my feed is going to be the lucky winners. So I would need their address so I can send it to them and then whatever spray that they wanna order. I'm gonna send it directly to them. So, and, sorry my husband was just calling me. Okay, so, the other day, the other day I turned how many years old? How many years old did I turn? Remember the first two people that I see popping up in the comments right here. And I know your comments might not drive with my comments because I've seen that happen in the past. But as soon as I see the right one come up, okay, Heather Lankford. Heather Lankford's the first one. So Heather, Put me down or message me with whatever spray you want. I think you won one last time too. That's what happens. You watch me every day. You pay attention. I love it, girl. Love it. Good morning, Megan. What's up, Kathy? So who's going to be my second winner? Waiting, waiting, waiting. I don't see anything on my screen yet. Yeah, Heather. Oh my gosh, we have people, you guys. And Olivia Spencer. So Heather Lankford and Olivia Spencer, you guys are the winners of these awesome sprays. So you get to pick one of these. And if you aren't, what I can do is I can message you this and you can see what's in them and then you can pick which one you want. Um, Heather, because you are already part of this, you may know which one you want already, so you can message me. And I think I have your address already. Um, but Olivia, I know you're new to the game in this biz. So um, tell me, I'll send you what these are and um, you get a pick and we'll go from there. All right guys, well I gotta get off to my massage. So I hope you guys have a awesome Thursday. Get out there, remember this is Thoughtful Thursday. Get out there and do something kind for some somebody or send them a letter or send them a message. Remember Junior dropped his his address in here. So let's all send Junior a nice a nice card or letter in the mail. Let's encourage him because remember he is, um, his body is not being nice to him right now. So I love you guys. I will see you tomorrow. Tomorrow is gonna be Flex Friday. So we're gonna talk about um, nutrition and workouts and that kind of stuff. So, and I'm interested in learning, ask, finding out from you guys how you like how I'm changing this this past week or if you'd want to go back to the real life stuff or uh, motivational stuff, or we can just try to do a mixture of things. So I love all your feedback and um, you guys have an awesome day and I'll see you tomorrow at 8.30 a.m. Pacific time on another Dozen's Daily Dose. Bye guys.